Welcome back to the long, dark, burning dog fans. We're here in the Milton Credit Union, which is uh, not proving hugely useful so far. But, you know... This I need. Office. Need to find a gas station. I could eat a horse. It's very filling for soda. Honestly, at this point, yeah, break that fucking thing open and eat old stale candy. Medicinal plants of Great Bear. A note with information about how to use plants to cure maladies. Okay, how do I do that? Uh... Frozen corpses! Okay, I don't know how to do that. Oh. Fine. Oh no. The gas station is ages away. Ah, oh, piss. I better head out if I want to get there before dark. Which is not something I've ever actually said before in my life. Hmm. Can I...? No, I cannot, said a uh, waypoint. I'll just turn in this direction. And hope for the best. That was a dead person. I sound like I've constructed armor from pots and pans, but, you know. Milton Hidden Cash Note. Huh. Hey, girl, that grumpy jerk at Orca left the back door open, so I snuck in and took some stuff. I thought we might need it for when you get out of here. I can't wait to get over to the mainland with you, where we can we'd finally be together for real. I'll meet you there tomorrow night like we planned. I stashed the stuff near that big fallen tree in the uh, marshy area. Uh, behind St. Christopher's, you know, where we met that one time and drank your dad's contraband. Noted. And I've taken a screenshot of it. So that I can refer to that, if I ever actually make it that far in the storyline. No? Okay, fine. Man, nature has reclaimed this place basically immediately. Okay. Here's where they keep their important rocks. I could just drag one of these logs back over there. I'm just saying. It's an option. I don't think it'd be very much fun, but... No gas. Oh good, there's a deer over there. Never know is deer are more delicious than pilots. There is a machine gun in it.
Let me guess, there's nothing here because those guys stole everything. Oh fuck, there's a person here. He's not dead or anything. Hey, sup. Well, another stranger. Have you escaped the town? Uh... Escaped the town? No, I just arrived. Not a refugee from the highways, then. You look weary, traveler. Come, warm yourself by the fire. Who are you? I'm nobody. But you can call me Methuselah. I'm here to witness the passing of an age. What do you mean, the passing? Don't you see the signs? Methuselah is the name of a man from the Bible who lived to be 200 years old because God loved him so much. Or something like that. The point is that he's the old... Uh, if, you know, if he was real, he was the oldest person who ever lived. It's a strange thing for someone to name himself, since I've only ever actually heard it used in that as a nickname, as an insult, to indicate that someone is very, very old. You seem oddly familiar, old man. Is that right? Yeah. And this whole place feels strange and empty. The quakes changed everything here years ago. Great Bear's back was broken, and it's been laid low ever since. Then what are you still doing here? Aren't we here to witness an apocalypse of an apocalypse, you and I? What? No one thought the world would end this way. But how could they not have seen it? It's probably just the storm. Power failure. I'm sure everything will be back to normal in a few days. I'm not sure anything will ever be back to normal. Ominous. I'm looking for my friend. She was with me when my plane crashed. But it looks like she must have made it out alive. Have you seen anyone pass by here? Many people have passed. All have gone into the town. I haven't seen any come back. What is this town? I don't recall seeing it on any maps. This is Milton. <laughs> Paradise Lost. I see what you did there. It's a town of the old world. Discarded. Left behind. You won't find much hope. I need to find my friend. I'm not sure you'll find any friends here. You're not much of a conversationalist, are you, Hippie Santa? Any idea why all the cars are stalled and left behind? They all stopped running? People abandoned them. Nothing but metal coffins now. You always this cheerful? Yes. My heart weeps for you, stranger. My days are nearly finished, but you'll have to live with what remains. Shit. Go safe, flee, and good luck to you. That was weird. I hope you find what you're looking for. Yep, I can't steal his uh, cane and break it down. Methuselah. Ancient in appearance, Methuselah's clear eyes suggest a deep wisdom, and he radiates strength rather than frailty. He has the calm, calm, knowing authority of someone who's seen a few things in his time. Methuselah appears to know more than he's letting on about the events on Great Bear Island. Uh, no, thank you. I'm just on my radio, or my uh, hotkeys, or whatever. Can I just, you know, be? Okay, put that away. Put that shit away. Beef jerky! Dry and salty. Package of beef jerky, tasty, and pretty much lasts forever. Ingredients, beef, sugar, soy sauce, salt, cayenne pepper, and natural flavors. Made in Canada. Delicious.
fish. Man, well, you got a bottomless stomach. That was a whole package of beef jerky. I'm gonna drink this one. I assume this is just off brand Mountain Dew because it is called Summit Soda. Uh. Okay. Huh, everything is oddly natural here. And a product of Canada. I've never seen it on shelves, for the record. But again, Toronto isn't exactly the North Wilds. Yoink! Coffee beans. You know, guys, I'm starting to think this is a Canadian developer. No? Okay, fine. I'll leave it. I guess it's not plugged in. Oh, shit. You're not Take just paying it on. Peaches! Of course it's cold. You don't warm up peaches, you maniac. Who eats hot fruit? Oh, oh, fire barrel. Hmm, apparently I'm going blind because I can't read a single one of those words. Oh. Low volume fu fuel source designed to help start fires. X lighter fluid. I would have put IE instead of X, but whatever. Highway robbery. Hey, bud. Sorry to leave you hanging like this with the storm and the power and everything, but it sounds like it's all gone to hell out of the upper bridge tonight. Car is broken down, a mess. And some rich mainlander won't budge from his truck. Probably thinks we're all a bunch of bandits waiting to rip him off, usual story. Anyway, me and Jason are gonna go up there and see if we can dock some sense in him before the storm gets even worse. I'll sort you out in the morning. Thanks, Peter. That'll come in handy. That's a lot of matches. Some more. Worn cotton toque. Simple knitted cotton hat. Not as warm as wool, but better than nothing. I have left it behind. Into the turret. I can see there's nothing here. It's fine. Oh man, I don't know what to take anymore. I need 8,000 food. I'm guessing that's 8,000 calories. I don't like the fact that my, uh... The weight I can carry is dropping. What am I carrying it's taking? Oh, fuck! There's a bunch of food here. I have to close it first, or you can actually try to search it again. Well, I am exhausted.
Maybe that's it. Maybe it's because my fatigue is too low. There was a bed back here. Uh, yeah, okay. What's the difference between fire starting base chance and chance of success? Now it's gonna be someone else's reheated coffee. But fuck it, I guess it's the apocalypse or something. Actually, I should probably not drink that if I'm about to sleep. <laughs> find out what happens. Ooh, that's quite good. I'll just rattle my way on out of here. Provides a boost of stamina and reduces fatigue for a short while. Distracting headaches may follow. <laughs> what do they put in this shit? I'll take it, but uh... I'm sure we drop some shit. That's a lot of food. I can bring a lot of that back for uh, the old lady. You go there? Let me see... Sort of by weight, I have a bunch of, uh... Stuff. Hmm, I see your point. Yeah, you know your coffee is cold, I'm just saying. Oh, this is food. Here's, uh, let's see. Right, let's take these crackers back to the nice old lady who tried to shoot me. And, uh... I don't have anything else to add to that, actually. I'll just go. I figured that one out myself. I 
I didn't see that one NHL logo, the thing on the gas station, I mean. Yeah, that's the right direction. Oh, there's the timer. You know, there's a town near me called Milton, but uh, it isn't exactly a middle-of-nowhere shithole. I just find the name funny. I guess a lot of places reuse names, huh? Now I just need to remember which one was the one the old lady was in. Noted. do it for a look at uh, the long dark. Happy Boxing Day, incidentally. Since this should be going up on Saturday. I could use this. Is that better or worse than the one I have? Let's find out. I can't be wearing both of them, can I? No, I've just got double thermal underwear on. Okay, fine. That's what I thought that would do. This game is rougher than I expected. That opening was kind of brutal, to be honest. But, uh, it's definitely interesting. Now that I've got a bunch of shit, I don't feel so threatened by imminent death, I guess. It's near this one. There it is. Let's walk along, jostling my stuff. But yeah, if you want to see more of the long dark, let me know in the comments. I'm burning dog face, and uh... The next time I see you should be when I return to The Evil Within 2. But I hope you and yours are having a... You know, happy holiday. And I hope you've enjoyed this trip through Frontier Survival. Later.